It's a great day for a drive, especially in a 2018 Escape SE in ingot silver. It has gray cloth and leather trim seats with seating for five, four doors, and a hatch with a 1.5 liter four cylinder EcoBoost engine paired with an automatic transmission and all wheel drive. You also have a twin panel moonroof, a class two trailer tow hitch, as well as keyless entry keypad and many more features. Stay tuned, we're gonna have a look under the hood and inside and out. And if you'd like to take this beauty out on a test drive, you can book that online at islandford.ca. This is a 1.5 liter four cylinder EcoBoost engine. It's paired with an automatic transmission and it's an all wheel drive. Let's have a look inside. Speaker in the door, as well as power locks, windows, and mirrors. The driver's seat has power controls. The passenger seat is manually adjusted. Carpeted mats on the floor, and your lift gate release is located here. Lighting controls here. On the face of the steering wheel, we have our dash controls, cruise control, media with volume, and hands free dialing. When we start up the vehicle, you're going to see any important messages, your odometer reading and a menu that we can go through. So right now it's just gonna come up and we're gonna go into the main menu. Trip one, trip two, information, settings, and these all have sub menus. In the center, you're seeing the CD player. And right now we've got the display screen and we're in settings and you notice how it's dark and it's very easy to change that. We just go into our display, touch on it, and then we can change the brightness. So we can actually change that if we wanted to brighten it, but we can also change it to day. And then it'll just take a moment and see how nice and bright that is. There you go. I find it easier to read that way. You've got Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, your display, Wi-Fi, hotspot, Bluetooth, navigation, and we can go into different options. So we can go into audio. You'll see your sources. Let's turn down the volume and your sources am fm sirius satellite radio cd and bluetooth as well you've got your navigation in your map and when you put the vehicle in reverse you're going to see your backup camera view so the white lines are showing you the direction you're going as you turn the steering wheel dotted line especially because you've got that class 2 trailer tow hitch and green yellow red is how close you are to other vehicles or objects and then you've got your dual climate control, heated seats for both driver and passenger, your AC and max AC, front and rear defrost, as well as auto stop start, traction control, you've got your uh, USB and 12 volt, your shifter, electronic parking brake, couple of cup holders, little bin, and two tiers for your armrest. There's the shallow one when we click to the right and the deeper one with the USB outlet when you click to the left. Your glove compartment's off to the side. You also have a manually dimming rear view mirror, lighting controls, sunglass holder, and you have a moonroof here that is powered as well as the screen. So you can just open that right up. And there's a grab handle on the side, just making it easier to get in. Wheels, splash guards, body color door handle, keyless entry keypad, a little bit of a spoiler in the back with a windshield wiper and your backup camera's located just below your Ford badge, backup sensors on your bumper, a class two trailer tow hitch. And then when you wanna open it up, simply put your hand in the latch and it'll lift right up very easily. Lots of room back here. You've got a 12 volt and a light hooks and tabs to be able to tether things, a little bin off to the side. And then underneath your cover here is your spare tire and your funnel. And when you're ready to close it all up, you simply put your hand in the latch, pull down, in the handle I should say, securely closed, and then you can just lock it up and walk away or jump in and head out on your latest adventure. Storage and speaker in the door as well as power windows. There's seating for three in the back with a 60-40 split. You can easily bring the headset down by simply pushing the button and then pull the lever at the base. It'll bring the seat right down. You now have access to the back cargo area. On the back of the seats are anchors to be able to tether baby seats and then flip the seat back up into the upright position. And you've got these seat belt minders on the side so that just keeps them in place and then flip up your headrest. In the center is an armrest with a couple of cup holders, carpeted mats on the floor and slim pockets on the back of the front seats. You have air vents as well as a 12 volt up top, your twin panel moonroof, and you have hooks and handles as well as lighting. Your side, capless, easy fuel gas filler, privacy glass in the back windows. You also have roof rails, adjustable side view mirrors that are heated, halogen headlights, fog lights, and so many more reasons to visit us. If you like this video and would like to see more, please subscribe. We have plenty to share with you and we'd love to hear your comments.